When the movie Whip It came out six years ago, it elevated roller derby. But at that time, the sport was already alive in our area. The Omaha Roller Girls played their first game in 2006. And I love their names. They're preparing now for a new season. With us this morning, we got Rylan Gottesling, uh -huh. right? In the middle. Right, kind of the takeoff from Ryan Gosling. Yeah, thanks, right. Matt. She had to we explain that it. to me. And then <laughs> he was the only one who didn't so, get it. Okay. I got it. Then Southern Discomfort and Crash Heartless that. over here. Hi, hi, Crash. Hey, good morning. Nice so you guys ready for this Saturday? Oh, yeah. got a big one coming up, right? Yeah, yeah. How do you prepare for it? A opening a season, getting ready for this opponent. What goes into it? Lots of practice, lots of uh, loud music. <laughs> So who, are we playing, up? Who, who are we playing Saturday? What's going on? Oh, we're playing Iowa City Capital uh, Capital City Roller Girls from Iowa City. Are they do good? Are they are they traditionally a good team? Yeah. Do you get yeah. along well with your opponents? Yeah. You do? Yeah. It's not I'm as cutthroat so friendly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah but that. it gets nasty in there, doesn't yeah. it? Well, yeah, but we're also professionals. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, that, that's controlled a, nasty. That's a great controlled that's a great nasty. point because it doesn't get out of control. Right. I know you love having families in the stands, yes, and so yeah. you want to make sure that kids don't yes. leave and parents are shielding their it's eyes. It's family friendly. Yeah. Leaving in tears is, would is be bad. Is each night a double header mm -hmm. for you? Okay. So what are the basic concepts and rules? Let's go through this because I like to talk to those who are brand new to the sport and they don't even know what they're looking for yet. Yeah, this isn't fake, is it? No. no. This is real yeah. stuff. Like, you remember the 70s when they had some of the fake roller mm -hmm. derby and it Over was kind of like, yeah, it was kind of like, like wrestling. No, this yeah. is real yeah. stuff. So what are the rules, the basics? Um, a lot of it is about contact, so they don't want anything dangerous, like no low blocking below the knees, no hits above the head, uh -huh. things like that. So it's more like body checks. Mm -hmm. so but then like you, you over. almost, you skate in formations, mm -hmm. right? So yeah. you're, d what are the different positions for, for you three anyway? Well, we have jammers, pivots, blockers. So there's always five people on the track at once, a jammer and her four blockers, unless they're in the box. Is the jammer the one out front? Well, the back and the beat. Right. She gets out front to get if points. If you're lucky. Before oh, we, yeah. That's how you score. Jammer is the score. star. Before we talk about the positions, let's talk about the concept. Because oh. in soccer, you got to put the ball in the net. In football, you got to score a touchdown. What is the goal here? What are you trying to do? The jammer is the point scorer, yeah. so she wants to, she or he, depending on what kind of team, <laughs> wants to lap as much as possible. So they're skating as fast as possible, and they're maneuvering through the pack, which is comprised of both teams. Every opponent they pass legally, they get their point. Okay. We've got is there like a finish line at the end, or is it just, how does that it's work? It's time-based. Time, okay. Yeah. Uh, Jenny Cash. Mm -hmm. Mike, do you know where that name came from? No. <laughs> Jenny <laughs> Cash is here as well one? to help demonstrate, because I think it's good to see things yeah. in action. So what do you want to show us this? Hi, Jenny. What do you want to show us this morning, guys? You want to do your jump? Do you, what do you want to do? do you, well, I thought you guys have well, a bit. Don't you have a bit planned I out? Heard, uh, I heard something special. I heard Mike I like, was at the center. Yeah, right. I'd what? like to. Uh, what, what do you want? You know, last time I did the worm, but this time I like to jump over you. <laughs> what do you mean, jump over me? You sideways or lengthwise? Oh no, you're too you're too tall. I, I don't I'm have time. Do you need him to lay down? down? Sorry, down? sir. Okay, are we doing this, this way? Really? Okay. Do you need him this way this. or that way? That way. This way, this way. right? Yeah. Here, I'll I'm not going that way. I'm gonna. I've seen you jump. Yeah, that way. Oh, this is not gonna be good. You're going the wrong way. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> God, a bunch of jokers. This is what you do in roller derby. Okay, you ready? For a countdown? Okay. Okay. If you step on Don't me. talk. I wanna <laughs> Don't distract her. Get okay, ready. Let her focus. Okay. Uh. Did you get scared? Is your heart you get up? Well, <laughs> she went over the midsection. Right. <laughs> family friendly. Come on. How did, the, how did the four of you, and well, Jenny, you're not mic'd up, but just hang out here with us. How did you all get into to roller derby? And I think part of the cool, the cool part of the story is what you do in the real world. So what appealed to you about the sport, and then what do you do when you're not playing? Just everything. Um, I was a volunteer first, and I saw somebody do like a monkey roll. I'm like, I got to do that. Mm -hmm. And then I end up joining it. I work. I stay active outside. They had a monkey roll. Trying to be roll. discreet. <laughs> what, what about you, Crash? I'm a bartender and a server. Mm -hmm. And then why, why roller derby? What did you think was great about it? Um, I didn't know that it was like a real thing in Omaha. Mm -hmm. And I was wearing knee socks and a skirt. And a girl literally <laughs> approached me and was like, you look like you want to play roller derby. I was like, I do if it was real. And she's like, oh, I'm starting a league. So let's do oh, it. Oh, wow. So, That's you're cute. Can we talk about injuries? Because well, we, we we've had you guys on the show. Story. Well, we don't want to hear Southern stories. <laughs> right. Do we have any injuries, yes, like any serious injuries? Oh, come on. Yes, maybe you can answer this question since he doesn't want you to answer the last one. <laughs> Any injuries? 
Um, yeah, every year we have a couple girls from our boot camp usually that don't end up being able to play because they get hurt. Um, mm -hmm. There's broken ankles, legs. broken wrists, legs. But it's still worth it? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Definitely. They always come back. Yeah, yeah so they, they always come back. Always after yeah. They go home, they heal up, and then they come back. I saw it was a year or two ago. I saw on your Facebook page you posted some of those nasty injuries on oh, there. Oh, heavens. The be careful you go yeah. to that Facebook page. Yeah, Yeah, we used to have a whole album. <laughs> yeah. I think you still do, don't you? Did you take it What's, what's wrong on there? Uh, best way to get tickets to your games. If our viewers want to be there for the season opener, what do they do? Yeah, they can get tickets at, um, on the Mid-America um, yeah. box office or um, at $12 at the door. At the MAC and it's online at omaharollergirls.org. It's family friendly, so Absolutely. you can take the kids. Yes. It's fun for the kids. And we're starting an hour earlier this year, so the kids can get, get home and get to bed yeah, a little earlier. Kids, so. And kids are free. Yeah. Uh, kids free under are free. Yes. We're just showing you the first two nights, but there are, what, five total? Six. Six, so, yeah. and that entire schedule is online. Mm -hmm. If you'd like to watch the girls this spring and summer, take care and be careful heading home, okay? Yeah. <laughs> we we'll appreciate you all being here with us today. Do you wash those pads, those knee pads? <laughs> I, try. I try. We do. <laughs> <laughs> they're not like guys okay. where their gym bag could it's grow legs right. and it's walk off. Right. <laughs> all right. Hey, Thank thanks for stopping by. Good yeah. to see you guys. So she's the greatest female star ever. That's according to the American Film Institute. Next, see how the Durham Museum is celebrating Katherine Hepburn.